What is up everyone, Tyler here and I am back with another video. 240's in the garage. The past two days I've been detailing this thing and it has been a, a good struggle. <laughs> Here's where I'm at right now. The whole front half of the hood is done. So it looks pretty beautiful in my opinion. As we walk around the car, most of the rear end is done. It has not been sealed up or anything, just polished. It looks pretty amazing. I didn't get to show you guys what it looked like before, but I saved like a portion of the car. So, I'm uh, I really hope you guys could see this on camera. Okay, there you go. You can see it, definitely. The bird poo right here, I washed, clayed, and polished one of these and it still wouldn't go away. So I have to wet sand, which is pretty scary, so sand the car and then do the a heavy compound. This is definitely a first for me. I never would have thought you'd have to wet sand the car to get off this bird poo. Literally the bird pooed on my car on a hot day when I was kind of far from home and maybe about two hours later when I got home, I'm assuming the hood got a bit hot because of the engine running and the heat. All that combined, within two hours, it etched into the paint. And man, was I upset because I washed a car. But oh, I thought I was all good. And then I went to a friend's house and I was in the right lighting. Bam, I saw the bird pew. So I went ahead and started detailing this whole car. But I really didn't want to detail the car until later on. I guess it all worked out and the car's gonna be perfect. If you take a look here, there's spots all over the hood. And that's not, like, that's not spots that you could really wipe off. I'm pretty sure that's oxidation. You could, if you take a look over here, the back half of the hood is not polished. Here you go. You could see the swirls and they all of a sudden disappear. There's a definite line where I polished right here. Let me know what you guys think of the before and after. I think it's a pretty big difference and when people see in my when people see my car in real life they'll be way more impressed. Another thing on the car that came with the previous owner was this tire rubbage because his fitment was too on point. So, it used to be way worse, but what I did was got Simple Green, sprayed it, and then a plastic razor, scrape off the rubber. This is all I could get though because this rubber is like on there, on there. Don't worry, I got some of this car pull eraser to clean off the Simple Green before I polish. Actually, this isn't polished yet. I'm gonna get to that. Um, uh, First, I'll show you what this side looks like. See how it's black right here? I don't know if I could get this side out, but I can't wait for this whole thing to be finished because it's taking so long. Yeah, this is where I'm at currently. I'll check up with you guys every so often when I'm detailing because it kind of slows down my time. It'll all be worth it when I'm done. Hey, can't wait. What? Yo. Fucked it to the 1975. I was popping hella pills and she was doing lines. Living life like rock stars, I just opened up her mind. Gonna get to wet sanding. This is the most scariest part. I just fucked it to the 1975. I was popping hella pills and she was doing lines. Living like right, the first round of polishing did not take out the bird poo, so I sanded it a little more in their specific areas, and I'm gonna hit it with a, a harsher compound. This will get rid of these heavy sand marks. Not really too heavy, 3,000 grit, so it's still pretty fine. RJ's here, RJ. Wait, what? Where's he at? Oh, he's right there. Oh, I'm gonna scare him. Whoa! Damn boy, oh my god. What up? This is him aired out. 
Jeez, man. Car's looking good. Hey, Lou. How high is that? That's so high. Wait, you're gonna ride like this? Why? Because your rear is like. There's definitely lower ride height than all the other back people. Yeah. Alright, we'll see. Alright. See you next time. See you soon. We got more to come. Oh yeah. Alright, see ya. See ya. I feel it, we love it's not real. Okay, back to detailing the car. Five. I was popping hella pills and she was doing lines. Living life like rock stars. I just here it is. I tried my best to get as much of the etching off. Yeah, right there a little. Over there too. It's very hard to see though. For the most part, though, if you look in this general direction. You used to be able to see it, but now you can't really. We take a look over here. Most angles you are not going to be able to tell at all. I'm sure most of you guys don't want to see me detail this car because I've detailed multiple cars in past videos. It's the same thing. So far the car's looking great and exceeded my expectations, honestly. Like, this paint is pretty damn near what the G's paint looks like. And surprisingly, for a 91, looks good and takes a beating. I am very impressed. Another quick before shot is this fender. If you can tell by the light, it has a lot of swirls, obviously, because this car's old, but if you look closely too, it, it, it has a bit of haziness. I think it's because the simple green I used to get off the tire, but there is still a good amount of tire on there. Let's see what happens to that because it's really hardened up on there. This little scratch most likely will get out. Yeah, man. Can't wait. Just gonna layer it up. See if that does anything. Kind of doing something. A good note. Look at how much rubber I got off. There's still some, but I, I'll deal with it. It. This side's way better. Literally no rubber, literally no rubber on the actual fender, but in the inside it is. It turned out super good because he wasn't rubbing that bad on this side, so uh, the rubber didn't harden onto the fender forever. I think at least it's forever. Boy, does this look good though. Oh. I think that's gonna do for today's video. The 240 is coming along great. Um, better than I expected actually if you guys want to keep updated with me go on over to my Instagram And I also have stickers for sale in the description down below There's only white stickers at the moment because the black ones I already gave all those away Yeah, thank you guys again for watching my videos and stay tuned for the next video